WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this 18th day of December, just about to wrap up the year. Wow. Isn't that quick? All right, so we're looking at the Dow down a dollar at 28,266. Could not over the last two days break that 28,337 high of three days ago. So it's kind of stuck. It's not, it's holding really well when you consider what's going on here, talking impeachment and all. But hey, um, this is a market that has been seen buying all year. It doesn't want to give it up at the end. I think it's the last few days if we've got a watch of the uh, last few days of the year. But right up until now, I've got this as a B and it should go to a C in the Chapman Wave methodology. I think we've got a little higher to go. There's some resistance levels above in the 28,400s. We'll see what happens. In the meantime, key support is 28,120, just on a very short term basis. S&P. So the S&P right now is up $1.89 at 31.94. Uh, at this particular point, what, what you're looking at here is a little slowing with these two tiny candles so far. Well, today is young. We've still got uh, four hours to go. But in the meantime, we're looking at the technicals very strong in the daily of the Dow, the daily and the S&P, the daily and the QQQ, and the QQQ index 100 is trading up 54 cents at 209.93. It did make a new all-time high today. That's really uh, quite impressive. IWM, the Russell 2000, is trading. Uh, it is 164.81 was the high of uh, four of five days ago, and today it went a little high. It went to 165.09. I'm now calling this a new leg C uh, in the daily, and the technicals have improved quite a bit. What's really important here is, well, besides how the market reacts to all the uh, political news, minus one in the gold, 1479. That should be screaming if it was really worried about um, the United States at this particular point. So we, we, we should be looking at 1493 maybe even 1503. We're not. We're looking at just a meandering gold and silver position here. Silver is also down a fraction. But the dollar seems to have got a little bit of traction here. It's up 19 cents at 97.39. I'm going to talk more about it in my show coming up. The Tiger Technicians Hour, I'm also the author of the opening call uh, daily newsletter. So we're, we've got a lot to discuss. We've also got to look at uh, a question about the TBT, that's inverse of TLT, that's bonds. We'll be looking at that because of that H pattern that I always talk about. We'll be back in a few minutes. Otherwise, have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow.